Is that good? I can't. Look at how cute he is! Hello everyone, my name is Annika and welcome to the channel and welcome to the video. Today's video is my top 15 most recent, no, hold on, let me think about how to wear this. My top 15 most recent purchases. Woo! How to get it out there. I got everything laid down on my bench. I got my notebook full of prices. Everything is under $50, so nothing too crazy. And I got some good recommendations. Let me just tell you. We have everything from clothes to accessories to skin to energy. So let's get started. First thing. Let's start with the good old Simple Modern Cup, okay? We know we're Stanley girls now, but up in here we are Simple Modern girls. This one just looks so much more like girly and like quaint to me. I don't know, I just really, really love it. And I love how it's just all one color and there's obviously no like, I don't know, I just didn't love the tops of the Stanleys and I love the top of the Simple Moderns. It comes in a ridiculous amount of colors. There's so many colors. This one is the 40 ounce, same as Stanley, and it is $30. I got it off of Amazon. You can obviously get it off of the Simple Modern website as well, but highly, highly recommend this. My eye stays 24 hours, I would say, probably in this, and it doesn't spill, like, ever. Obviously, out of the straw it does, but not out of the hole. So, love, 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 love this. I did influence mom to get one, because I, I just can't go anywhere without it now. This is actually, I know I said top 15, but this cup made the list 16, but 15 is just more aesthetic to say. <laughs> so, first item. My second item is Weasley. I'm just kidding. Oh, it's his nap time. It's like midday. It's his nap time. Okay, what should we do next? Listen, okay. The next one, obviously I'm going to love anything from them. But these right here. The Elani New Six. They are the same as the energy drinks, but just in a little stick powder form. You put it in water and you're ready to go. It's not pre-workout because they do have pre-workout, but it's just their energy drinks. And I love this because sometimes I'm just not feeling carbonated drinks, but I want an energy drink. So I just throw this in water and it's so good. The thing that gets me is Elani's like rack up. Like I like to have Milani every day but that's not realistic because they do rack up in price throughout the month if you have one every day but these are $15 and the vitamin shop usually is where I get them and they usually have a sale going on where it's buy one get one 50% off you're basically getting 10 Alani's for the price of like three Alani's so that is just a great deal to me and it's a break from the carbonated energy drinks which is also a great thing they come in four flavors right now I think it's Cosmic Stardust, Cherry Slush, Breezeberry, and I'm not sure of the second one. I mean the fourth one, so these recommend. Next up, this is a recent repeat purchase for me. This is the Milk Sunshine Skin Tint, and probably over the last year and a half, any makeup look I've done, this is what's underneath it. This is my foundation. This is the only foundation I've used for the past year and a half. And it's just so good and glowy and natural. I've not found anything that I like more. And this just goes for the look that I need every single time. You can put as much to look like a foundation when it's really just a skin tint. Or you can really use it as a skin tint. I used it more as a skin tint today. But every makeup look I've done, I've used this. It has a roller applicator. It makes it where you like pump it out and then you can roll it all over your face. And it's so, it distributes it so evenly so you don't have splotchy. And that is very good for me because I use a brush, not a sponge. So it does get kind of splotchy sometimes if I don't roll it. So that is why this one is my favorite. There's also a concealer that goes along with this line that I had tried. I think I got it just a little too light, but I think I would, if I would have gotten the correct shade, I would have loved it just as much. And this is $42, which is kind of a lot for a skin tint, but using it as a foundation as well, it's not on my upper, more pricey side for foundation. Also, I just love anything by Milk. They're so good. Okay. <laughs> Next up, there's not going to be much explaining needed because it is so explained on TikTok. But the bronzy drops, I know I fell victim to them. They're just so good. I've seen a lot of people say they don't work for them, 
but they work gorgeous for me. They just, when I'm feeling like I just want mascara and my brows done, I throw this on and I feel like I actually put effort when I didn't. I did try the Drunk Elephant Moisturizing that goes with the bronzy drops, but I, it was a little bit expensive and I got the Curology at Target. They now carry it in Target for $17. It also has a pump like top, the same as the Drunk Elephant. And I like this one better. It's more, it's, I don't know. The Drug Elephant was just very heavy for me. And this one was just a lot lighter and I liked it a lot more. So I do the Curology Moisturizer with the Bronzy Drops. It's a magic, magic duo. Highly, highly recommend this, especially for summer when you just want to, you're going to go run errands with friends and you can just throw this on. Highly recommend. And they're starting to get in stock now. I was on the wait list for so long and then i walked in support the other day and there was like a full stock just displayed so like they're coming back they're getting back in stock so get you some bronzy drops like i said the curology was 17 dollars and the bronzy drops are 38 but they do last you a while because you only got to do a little keeping on the face skincare genre glossier listen 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 i am a glossier girl but it, I just didn't like ordering it online. But now that it's in Sephora, it's game changer. The camera died. I'm not even using my camera and it's still following me around. I guess all cameras that I use die. Anyway, I've gone to Sephora for Glossier four times. Just for Glossier in the past two weeks. Because it's just so nice to look at and I love all of their stuff. I have their perfume. I have their concealer. I have their eyeliner. Such a good eyeliner. I have so many things and it's so nice to be able to get them in Sephora now. I used to always go to me went to New York, but now we get to have it in Sephora. I'm so excited. So I have an unpopular opinion when it comes to the bomb.com. I like the new applicator, okay? I think I honestly didn't get the old one because I just didn't want to put it on with my finger. I wanted to be able to be driving and put on some lip gloss. And it just required too much and be on my fingers. And I just, I didn't love it. But these are really, really good. And there's a, the hole is still big enough to where if you wanted to put it on your finger, you could. And I think they did that on purpose. But it's nice to be able to just put it on there. And the birthday, mm, the birthday is so good. I used to keep a Laneige in my car. And then when bomb.com became easier access, I was like, okay, I'm gonna keep that one in my car. And I got this to do that. I found myself wanting it too much when I was up here. So I brought it up here, went and got another one and put the mint in my car. So now I have the birthday and the mint. And then I think when this one runs out, I'll probably get the fig, cause that's the one everyone else loves. I haven't tried too many, but very excited about this one. It is only $14, so cheaper than Laneige, and I like them the same, honestly. Okay. <laughs> Next up, we do have some dupes. Because dupes are dupes for a reason. They're good, okay? First, y'all saw this in my Road to Nationals vlog. No, not my Road to Nationals. My Nationals, maybe? One of the vlogs. Y'all saw this. This is the little Stony Clover pouch dupe that we got in our gift baskets, our swag bags, whatever you might like to call it. And it is such a good size. I have found myself really using this so much just because it's such a good size. And when I've been going out with friends, I put the digital camera in here, I put my lip gloss, and I put some batteries in there. And that just, it stays with me. It's the perfect size. It's not too big to have to carry around. And you just throw it in your bag. It has the A. It is so cute. It is the Sony Clover dupe. I did love this so much. I did end up getting actually the actual Sony Clover. And I have to say, like, I like this one just as much, if not more, because it's not as, like, stiff. But I really, really recommend this size, especially for college, maybe. Like I said, being able to keep little things in there and have it by you. So good. And then, once I got this one and loved it so much and I couldn't stop carrying it around, Mom surprised me with this one. I used to keep my skincare in, well, I keep it in my drawer to do it on in my bed because I keep it in the traveling pouch. So when I travel, I just get the pouch and put it in my bag. And it was, it was a little rough. It was, and it didn't fit everything at all. I'm sorry. I'm not disturbing you. It didn't fit everything at all. So mom surprised me with this one. It was, both of these are $13 on Amazon. I think the pouch, I don't exactly know for this one. I'll link one similar, but since it was in our swag bags, I don't have the exact link and I don't believe it came with the patches, but this one did come with the patches, $13. It's huge. Like it's really big. 
It fits all my stuff with I got my vitamin D, my Benadryl, and my magnesium. I have all of my stuff in here, all of my moisturizers, like big stuff in here. And there's still so much room. All my washaws, everything. I really, really recommend this one. And it's such a good pink. For $13, it's huge for $13. So I'm really, really happy with this one. The stickers are all staying on so good. And I'm very happy mom surprised me with this one. So, highly recommend both of these. This one's just so perfect. I love it. So, $13 plus patch. Don't have the exact link. Have the exact link. $13 with four patches. You're good. Get these. Next, we're going to do some swimwear. I have a more affordable and then I have more of a little bit of a splurge for you. I'm going to do the splurge first just because I couldn't get myself to splurge on it for so long, especially not knowing how it was going to be, whatever, and I finally got myself to do it and man is it worth it. The Skims swimsuits. Okay, this is the Skims tank bikini top. I sized up in both of these and I got a size 8 and they fit me good. I honestly maybe could go up in bottoms one more if I wanted to, but I'm able to put it up where I want it and it's not like small. I, if I would have gotten true size, I would have gotten six, but I knew, let's be real estate, I want to be able to move it around if I need to. So I got an eight. And with my top, it's just obvious I have to size up. And it really covers what you need to. It doesn't look like it would cover, but it really does. And it like holds everything in place. There's no like spillage over. And the straps aren't super thick for the covers that it has. I found that with bigger chests, the more coverage you get here, the bigger the straps get. And you just get more tan lines. I'm so glad that this doesn't have it. And the band is super supportive, so it's not going to come up and show anything. I'm really, really happy with both of these. These are the Cheeky Tanga Bottoms, and like I said, I saw that they went down a little bit more in the front, and I like it to come up in the front, so I sized up. I highly would recommend sizing up if you like it like that too, and they're just so cute. Okay, the top is 48, and the bottom is 32, so like I said, a little bit of a splurge, but if you need just one nice bikini, especially for spring break, I'm definitely taking this one to the beach with me. So excited. The next one me and mom actually did have to fight over. It is from Target. And Target has like, I'm feeling pink and orange this year for spring, summer. I don't know why. I just think they go so cute together. So when I saw this, me and mom did have to fight over it, but she ended up getting it. So this technically isn't my purchase, but I wish it would have been. It could have been, but it ended up being hers. It's a full set from Target. It's the top. I'll show you more of the detail up and close, but it's the top, the bottoms. I love the bottoms, how they like line right there and they're not thick. And then a sarong. It's just so cute. It's the perfect pink and it's like a terry cloth texture, wavy. It's just such, such a vibe. And I'm definitely gonna be stealing this still because it's just so cute. Maybe once. She leaves to go on vacation, and I have like one day until I go on vacation. I will go to Target and get myself one. And then, surprise, we can match. We can match from different beaches. How about that, Mom? But it's so cute. The way it fits her is gorgeous. It makes me want it even more because it fits her so good. And it's a line at the top. We know how I feel about lines at the top. Can you not? You are in a mood today. You are in a mood today. Stop it. Stop it. Sorry, my child is disrupting. Mwah! So yes, highly recommend this one. I did try on one of the other ones at Target. It was like the pink with the orange outlined. Did not fit my boobs good. You know which one would? This one. So I might just go get it. I am very picky about my brushes. I have two dry bar brushes just because I like them the best. And then I have a wet brush I keep in my bathroom that's like has like no back so I can use it in the shower. And then I just really wanted a square one because I love square ones. And this one is perfect. It's so weird to be like, Erica, you have a brush in your top 15 most recent favorite most recent purchases. Yes, I do. Listen, I'm so picky about my brushes and this one meets every criteria. It is plastic obviously, but it feels like hard so it doesn't, the like, this part of the brush 
the they're hard so they're not going to bend with the tangles i hate when they do, do that they just get stuck it goes right through i love square ones it's very cute purple highly recommend it says it's for detangling so good after the shower i love it love 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 if you need a new brush get this one. Oh, i'm so sorry i did not tell you the prices of the swimsuit this top is $18, the bottoms are $18, and then the wrap sarong is $20. So much more affordable than the skims, and still really good and cute. The brush also was $15 as well, and I got it from Target. I have two things left, and they're, I saved the clothes for last. First up, this little tee. I love a good flowy tee, but I want it to hit where you can still see my shorts just a bit, and this one does that. It's a beautiful pink. It is from Free People and it just lays on you perfectly. Sometimes with my bigger chest, I've found that it just, it doesn't lay good. And this one lays really, really good. I got a size medium and it still fits kind of oversized-ish. And then if I wanted it to be really oversized and like go over my shoulder, I would get a large. Boy, this is my nice new clothes. It just flows so good. It's gonna be nice to put over swimsuits even. And I really, really like it. And I think I'm gonna get it in the like ivory color. Also, this is not in my list, but it's gorgeous and it will be linked with all of this stuff as well. If you need a new tee that's like cute, but still lounge, throw on, whatever, highly recommend this one. And with it being free people, I was kind of expecting it to be a little expensive. And it definitely is for a t-shirt, but not as free people expensive as I was expecting. It was 38. So the next shirt I'm about to show you is like around the same price and it's not as nice as this one. So I do think that this is somewhat of a good deal. And lastly, lastly, we have this little offline square tea moment it's once again obviously i'm feeling the pinks i got a pink shirt on now i showed you a pink shirt we're on another one this is more of a workout shirt and it is square neck like i love i can usually only do square or high neck for workout tops especially and this one was so bright and vibrant color that i had to get it it was 31 dollars, so only like five ish dollars in between that one and the, and the free people one it does have like a little built-in well, something something underneath but obviously that's not enough for bigger chest girls and it does also have flare legging and biker shorts to go with it i got the flare leggings and they cross in the back and the front like they do the crossing in the front and the back so they're a bit weird so they're not going to make this list but the shirt does make the list and also the shorts were only four inch and i usually like to go six inch inseam so the shirt, the shirt made it to the list, but nothing else did. And I just really, really love it. I feel like it's, once again, going to be so good for summer. I, once it hit like 71 day, was in the summer mentality, and I have not gone back. It is June in my mind, and it is um, the 6th of March. So not anywhere near June, but in my head it's June. So yeah, I love this one, and I love the color of it. And that is a wrap. Wow. Okay. I hope that you guys got some good suggestions from this. I know some of the stuff like the bronzy drops, you've already probably been suggested, but I like to give my input because not, not everyone's the same. So obviously I did like them. And the milk skin tint, if you need something for this summer, I really could not recommend this more. It is one of my genuine favorite products in my whole skin makeup routine i'm like keep looking over there and be like is there anything i like more than this and i just i really don't think so there is if you want to get a little bit of a more affordable version there is the bliss skin tint i'll link it also it's a little bit the same but definitely not as much coverage this is truly like to me a foundation i just i could i can't recommend this enough go get this it's at spora what else is milk sold honestly i don't even know what ulta carries anymore because they don't have glossier, so <laughs> that's what I'm looking for. Speaking of, this stuff is all genuinely the stuff I use on a daily. Like, I like to change clothes quite a few times a day. I have to wear those shirts, this sweatshirt. I use all these products every day. I've gone to the hot tub many times since I got this, only worn this. This is genuinely the stuff that I would recommend to you guys, and I think it's worth what I paid for. I did pay for all these. I hope that you got one good suggestion for yourself. Treat yourself to a little something before summer. All these things are under $50, so nothing too crazy. Oh, it just feels so good to hopefully recommend one thing to you guys. 
and I love you guys so much for watching. I'm gonna go drink my Lonnie little stick and go work out, and I'll see you in the next one.